Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome back to Harmony of the Seas. It is day number four. We are on our way to San Juan, Puerto Rico right now. We got up, got moving, just had some breakfast in Johnny Rockets again and getting ready to get our day started here and as we're heading to Puerto Rico. We don't have anything specific on plan. We're just gonna get off and check out old San Juan and kind of roam around and see where it goes from there. So join us again. My name is Cody. Thank you so much for watching. Let's have a great day. Lily's still in her jammies this morning. She's been a little fussy, but we're uh, we're gonna head up, get changed, and get into some stuff before the ship gets docked in San Juan at about one o'clock. Looks like they're out here doing some work on the Aqua Theater. You saw our video a couple nights ago. We saw the Fine Line show out here. That's an amazing show. Very amazing, very talented performers here on board Harmony of the Seas. And now we're getting an inside look at the Aqua Theater. And it's actually a little overcast today. I felt a few sprinkles out here in the boardwalk. Uh, a couple clouds in the sky, so hopefully those will clear away. Well, apparently our ship's arrival time has been changed back an hour, which is uh, a little unfortunate. That would put us getting in at 2 o'clock instead of 1 o'clock today. Just hanging out in the blue water behind us on our way to San Juan. Lowrider! Mini golf is packed. Alright guys, I think I'm gonna go try to do the zip line real quick. There's not much of a line, so I'll take advantage of that while I can. I right, guys, just did the zip line. Uh, couldn't film anything. They won't let you take anything on it. I mean, down to my wedding ring, necklace, watch, every single thing had to come off. Couldn't put it in your pockets, anything like that, uh, which is a little interesting. But man, that was really fun. Pretty cool. Again, one of those interesting things that you can do on an Oasis class ship that just adds to the experience that is Royal Caribbean. Time to get off the ship and go explore Puerto Rico. All right, we've made it off the ship. We are in old San Juan, Puerto Rico. We've got us a pirate ship over here. Arrgh. It's a beautiful look at Harmony of the Seas. All right, first impressions. It's very Americanized here, you can tell. Um, they've got Subways, Ralph Lauren, Cold Stone, uh, very Americanized. These long cobblestone roads, all up and down, every way. Still got the Christmas tree up here in this little town plaza that we've made it to. The hills are getting much, much more the further we walk around here. It's kind of like some sort of interesting combination of San Francisco and New Orleans with a Spanish theme. Good old Wendy's. We've reached close to the governor's mansion. This is as close as we can get. And this is the street where they hang stuff all throughout the sky. Sometimes it's umbrellas. Right now it looks like it's actually doves up there in the sky. This would look gorgeous at night. This is the chapel of the Christ, of Christ the Savior. Look at all the birds. They are everywhere and they don't move. They do not want to move. Apparently this is called Pigeon Park. They're everywhere. They're even landing on people. Check 
out this view, you've got our ship over there. We'll come over this way. We've got the bay over here, just as calm as it can be. Gorgeous. Just walking down the streets. This is one of the main uh, main roads here. Fortalenza, I think is how you say it. Just walking around and checking everything out. Check out these doors to this building. It looks like an old jail cell. Just popped in the souvenir store and got us a couple things to bring home. We're having fun. Oh, passing by the statue over here in the Central Plaza. I'm not 100% sure what this is. We're over here near one of the forts, so it's got to be some historical figure. And there's uh, one of the old forts here in San Juan, up there at the top. Didn't make it in time to get inside to see it, but we can at least see the outside of it. Coming back to this, it said is the Cristobal Colon statue. Yeah, that is there. Lily's uh, just chilling. Yeah, yeah. She's are. just chilling, We're hanging out. Sitting down for a minute right here underneath the fort. Just taking a break. Another look of the uh, Castillo Cristobal Fort here on the banks of Old San Juan. This is the uh, larger of the two forts. Uh, El Moro is on the other side of town, and we didn't make it to that one either. But this one's right here in the middle of the town. From what I understand, they built this to add extra protection um, after Fort El Moro was getting attacked and overran. They built this fort to help protect old San Juan back in like the 1700s. The moon's starting to peak out. It's getting uh, close to six o'clock local time and we're still just kind of roaming around checking everything out. Squeeze out. All right we're headed back to the ship. Back is not feeling too good so we want to call it take it an early night. We were going to get dinner out here but we want to get her back to the ship so we're headed back now. Get back on board Harmony of the Seas. Senor Frogs! We are coming back on her. Man, she's a massive ship. Well, since our plans got changed and we didn't get to have dinner in Puerto Rico, we've come back up to Windjammer tonight for dinner. And it is an absolute madhouse here right now. So, we'll see if we can get some food and get out of here. I already finished up dinner at Windjammer. It was. Yeah, at best. Mm -hmm. um, we popped down here. We're going to go in the comedy club and see the comedy show real quick while her parents watch Lily. And can't record any of this, so we'll see you in an hour. Quick look inside the comedy club before everything gets started here. This one's called The Attic. The comedy show's over. Uh, one of the two comedians was much better than the other one. Uh, we actually have seen that comedian once before on our last cruise ship. Uh, he's really good. I think his name's Lewis Johnson. Uh, he was really good. Um, so now we pop down real quick, grab a drink from the Bionic Bar, and then we're going to head upstairs, get Lily, and go take her to bed. Pop down to see the magician Martin Barak. Magic show is complete. That was uh, interesting to say the least. Uh, he did some tricks that I've seen a lot of uh, bigger known magicians do, such as Penn and Teller and stuff I've seen on AGT before that he didn't do nearly as well. <laughs> um, popped up here to deck 16 to say goodbye to Puerto Rico. We are headed out right now and uh, on our way to St. Thomas now. Stepped outside on the solarium real quick. A great view of old San Juan at night. You can see uh, the Fort Cristobal right over there. That's where we were at earlier today. And down that way is the rotunda for the Capitol building as well. It's a beautiful night here. We're getting ready to pull, pull out of the dock and head our way to St. Thomas next. All right, guys, we're going to end today's video right here. Um, it's been a fun day in Puerto Rico. We had some challenges, but we overcome everything. And we had a good time and happy we got to be here. We are headed on to St. Thomas now. And we're supposed to have a snorkeling excursion tomorrow and hopefully that goes well we're a little concerned uh, there's some confusion as to whether or not we leave at ship time or if we leave at local time which is an hour difference um, and if we leave at local time I'm not sure we're going to make the uh, tour so there's a little bit of confusion we've been trying to get in touch with the tour company not sure it's gonna happen but if it does happen 
we got to be off the ship at 7 30 in the morning so time to head to bed try to get a little bit of sleep and hopefully we get to wake up and have our snorkeling tour tomorrow in beautiful St. Thomas. Uh, my name is Cody. If you haven't yet, please hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. Uh, that would mean a lot. Uh, let me know in the comments what you like, what you don't like about the videos. Uh, if there's anything that I can improve on, uh, I would love to hear your feedback because uh, I'd like to get better at this. Thank you for joining us today and we will see you in the next one.